Ladies and gentlemen, boys and ghouls, step right up. Behind this curtain lies a ghastly concoction of delight, horror, fantasy, and terror. Your every wish is our command, your every whimsical desire brought to life. But I'm warning you, there's always a price. Welcome to the greatest show on earth! Dark Carnival is in town, you'd better be ready Just follow the parade of dancing skeletons Full of ghoulish delight around every corner Don't tell your parents you're here, they will soon be mourners Welcome to the lower bird, the greatest show on earth We appear without a sound, the darkest show around We will be here in a day, madness murders is made Disappear at night with blood upon the concrete I will be your ticket taker Come inside, it's a dream Enter the fun house of beers No one can hear you scream We can supply anything That your heart desires But the consequences Will surely be dire Welcome to the lower birth Show on earth, we appear without a sound. The darkest show around, we will leave you in a daze. Madness, murder, dismay, we will disappear at night with blood upon the concrete. Come inside for the ride, your deepest, darkest fears The best night of your life, you're never leaving here The unknown, the unseen is what you're gonna find Witness this, witness that, until you lose your mind Welcome to the lower bird, the greatest show on earth. We appear without a sound, the darkest show around. We will be here in a day, madness, murder, dismay. We will disappear at night with blood upon the concrete. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to the stream. Uh, I'm here with Rinny the Dragon, and we are about to get things started with Silent Hill 3. That cloister bell towards the end of the intro scared the shit out of me. I had to, um, I had to like keep my composure to keep up with the last chorus of the song. <laughs> oh, and I see we have a new follower. Well, welcome. Glad to have you aboard. Uh, I am Seth Aurelius, a.k.a. The Arbiter, a Time Lord on my second incarnation, exploring the many worlds AKA, or games that I come across in my travels. Um, I try to stream on the regular, but it's been kind of chaos recently, and I scuffed the visuals. Whoops. I can never... It's like, of all the Silent Hill games, I think that 3 might have the best music. It is definitely good. <laughs> You know what's funny? There was a song that I, for years I thought was a Silent Hill song, 
But I've downloaded like a bunch of Silent Hill um, games uh, soundtracks, and I can't find it in any of them. Huh. Yeah, because it has—it's like a very slow, somber violin piece with a bit of piano in the background, and for the life of me, like, I can't, like, replicate it anymore. It's been so long since I last heard it. I'd recognize it if I heard it, but I couldn't, like, hum it. Um, but it drives me nuts that I can't find it because I, because I misattributed to where it was from. Man, it's too bad I don't have a capture card for my PS3. I actually have the HD collection on my PS3, and I beat it once. Uh, I beat Silent Hill 3 once, and I unlocked the lightsaber weapon at the end. Um, LCP Anime Guy has disappeared. Oh, hey, L Anime Guy, welcome. Got a lurk because of work. Also, hi, guys. Well, uh, you know, enjoy your lurk, man. I'm glad to have you with us, be it lurking or, or actually, like, active in the chat. I appreciate everyone who tunes in. This game is, like, also really effective at being scary. Um, I am not this game's target audience. It's very clear that this was, like, meant to be, like, scary for teenage girls. But, and this is how you know it got me. I played this back in, like, 2020 during the peak of the lockdowns. And I'm just, do I'm just doing my thing. And I'm not even in the other world. I'm just somewhere. I think I'm in the church before it turns into the other world. My mom just comes into my room to ask me if, uh, if uh, to ask me something, and I jumped out. I nearly jumped out of my skin when she came when she opened the door. <laughs> <laughs> the only other game that's gotten that kind of uh, that kind of um, reaction out of me was Eternal Darkness: Sanity's Requiem. I don't know how they did it with that game, but they. Um, they absolutely mastered the art of making sound um, that's coming from your TV sound like it's coming from somewhere else in your room. I did not have a surround sound at the time of playing that game, and um, in spite of that, I kept hearing the game's audio kept sounding like it was coming from behind me. It fucked with me big time. That was really scary. Yeah. <laughs> um, although I will say this. The only, the, like, the game that scared me the most, and still does, is Fatal Frame. Fatal Frame is scary. I don't know if I want to stream it, because I might be too scared to, like, go anywhere. <laughs> yeah, I watched a Let's Play of it on my, like, iPhone 4 back when I was a teenager in uh, on a Saturday, and in broad daylight, I was too afraid to turn around in the bedroom of my own house. I was, like, even after, like, turning off the Let's Play. Um, uh, Kyrie, I still need to play this game. Dude, everyone should play this game. It's incredible. Action level. Normal or hard? I'm trying to remember what I beat this on. It might have been normal. And then there's me playing everything on easy. <laughs> Riddle level. <laughs> um... Are you feeling big brain? <laughs> it, here's the thing. This game is infamous for its riddle level. Um, on hard, specifically. It is a complete shit show. And so I will not be playing it on hard. I will play it on <laughs> normal. And if need be, we can look up the answers. <laughs> Oh gosh. <laughs> I, I I should be able to beat the I should be able to get past the riddles. Um I there's one part of the game where you actually mix ammonia and bleach. And um we all those of you who've been watching me since the Pokemon let's play that I did last month and had to put on hiatus for Spooktober, um, will know that I know firsthand why that is not a good idea. That is a very bad idea. You don't mix ammonia and bleach. <laughs> I uh, I was cleaning the dog room and there was pee on the floor and I absentmindedly just poured bleach on the spot and then I realized oh shit did I just make chloramine gas 
and <laughs> it's like I thought my mom was gonna go John Wick on my ass if I had if I had poisoned the dogs. I wasn't worried for my safety. I was worried for the dogs because I think my mom would end me if I hurt those dogs. <laughs> And I wouldn't blame her! <laughs> that was a very stupid decision! <laughs> and yet in this game, there's a part where you got these venomous moths that are fle that are- that'll like eat into you, that you can't go past, and that's the solution. Wait, what's the solution? Um, you get a bottle of bleach, and you get a bottle of ammonia, and a bucket, and you pour them into the bucket by the moths. Good news, we can run! Yeah, finally we did it! <laughs> and, uh, we can stab a bitch, too. Uh, tank control. No. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Oh, <laughs> uh, did I tell you, um, that story of I, I finished Resident Evil Zero? The entire thing on stream with Kyrie. I thought it was going so awesome, but you want to know what people didn't tell me? What didn't they tell you? The whole like four streams. The game never had audio. And oh no! One told me. <laughs> no. You know how often that happened to me when I was in my early days of streaming, back when I was yeah. still Seth Aurelius and not the Arbiter. I'm guessing. Yeah. There were several episodes of my, uh, I actually, my, the Star Wars Knights of the Old Republic 2, that, um, stream that I'm doing, that was, uh, that, that current Let's Play that I put on hiatus was not my first time playing it. The first time I played it, there was an entire episode where there was no footage captured and only audio. Uh. And there were several episodes where there was no audio but video. I am overjoyed that the days of that are, you know, I now have the pre-flight check and I don't actually... Why aren't you dying? I'm sorry, but uh, these are bullets. This is a fucking... This is a fucking 45 ACP handgun. You should be on the floor right now. There shouldn't no, there shouldn't be such thing as a locked door, let alone an upright monster when you're firing 45 ACP. Actually, no, I take that back. 45 ACP isn't the strongest thing out there. Wait, hold up. No, that looks more like a nine mm I take it back. Items, supplies. Guess I'm using the health drink. There we go. Oh, the cool thing about the pipe is it will substitute for uh, stomping on enemies. You don't have to stomp them if you whack them when they're on the ground with this. But stomping them is so, like, uh, what's, what am I looking for the word? Um, fun? Yes, fun. You're the worst yeah. one here. <laughs> you feel excited when you step on them and snuff out their lives. <laughs> oh, God. Satisfying, it's satisfying. There we go. Exactly. <laughs> also, I will be making religious jokes about Claudia and her dad. I'm, I'm just, I'm disclaimer right now. Oh gosh. <laughs> I'm, I'm going to be making fun of them. Because you know what their conflict boils down to? What? Claudia is basically a, a universalist and her dad is basically a Calvinist. <laughs> And, and I say that because her dad is like, you must be chosen by God to be saved. And Claudia believes that everyone is going to be saved but her. Oh, no. <laughs> yeah. Now, these people are not Christians, but there's... Honestly, I've looked into the Order's lore, and there's some bizarro-ass hodgepodge of Satanism, like, misinterpretations of Native American mysticism, and Catholicism. The order is weird, and that's p probably by design. Oh god, I hear drums. That's never a good sign. Oh god! I mean, I sing I can't decide during karaoke night. You, I have a replica of the Master's Ring. You don't want me hearing drumming. The drumming. drumming means it's happy fun time. 
Oh god, that thing back there, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I- Oh god, stupid pendulum! No, you know what, fuck this noise, I'm leaving. I'm out, bye guys. Oh god bless it, I can't jump that. I guess I'm go- No, no, bad. Bad insect, I think. It's called a pendulum, and they're the most annoying thing in the game. Easily. No! Oh, the cute chibi! Okay, I'm in rough shape. Oh, yeah, that, that makes sense. Uh, it's time for the machine gun. <laughs> because fuck Sounds all like you motherfuckers. Pew, pew, pew! Fuck, I'm out. Unfortunately, the bullets that you have in the inventory are only good for the handgun. Oh, really? Yeah, there's uh, the the machine gun needs a special magazine, or um, yeah, mag. Honestly, I have I I I'm not as like up. I, I am not like as tightly wound about like gun terminology, but it does annoy me when people call mags clips, because clips are a very specific piece of hardware. Oh, I didn't know there was a difference. <laughs> yeah, most people don't, which is why I try not to get too bent out of shape about it. Why can't I walk through this? I, that's what I'm supposed to do. Okay, yeah, here we go. Now, the reason you want to do this in the intro sequence when you could just leave by dying is that this actually is a premonition about a later part of the game. And it basically warns, it's like, if you try to do this when you actually get to the amusement park in the late game, you will die. Oh, that's really hard. Well, no, not because it's really hard, but if you just walk on these tracks, you, you die. You get, a ga you, get, you get sent back to the menu. Whoa. But well, why do you die? <laughs> because the car runs you over. What do you oh. think would happen if you run when you walk down uh, roller coaster tracks, Rini? <laughs> Fuck know. around and find out. <laughs> I've never seen this game actually finished before. Oh, really? Yeah, I don't know. I've I've seen all like almost all of the other ones, but not three. Yeah, I've played and finished three. I've played most of one. Um, like my best friend Jay, I got absolutely fucked when I got to the nowhere because there's no map, and you can wander infinitely in that. It is not a good time. Oh shit, I have a bag of candy corn. I completely forgot about this. Oh, no, not candy corn. <laughs> yes. <laughs> candy corn is base. You wanna know what I have though? <laughs> what? I have gummy crabby patty. <laughs> not terrible, but uh, not really for me. Pink GB, yay! Funny. Found out you're playing a game, a Silent Hill game, so I had to drop by for a bit. Well, glad to have you with us, GB. I know I told you the cute Cheepy was in the chat. <laughs> Silent Hill, one of the best ever. Uh, Akira Yami uh, Yamaoka is God tier co uh, amazing composer. He really is. He knows what he's doing. Y'all yeah. tell Seth gummy Krabby Patties are delicious and that he's crazy. <laughs> no. See, you yeah. can't. Rini, see, you got to learn to love the candy corn. <laughs> no. <laughs> yes. I will, I will throw candy corn at you. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'll put on a shirt with like super cleavage so you have something to eat. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh my god. Holy crap. You and me are very lucky that Rick isn't here right now. <laughs> we would have been bumped a lot. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> Oh my god. Rick is the Rick is the Rick is the guardrails that keep me on the straight and narrow. Well, at least Omen isn't here because then we'd be even worse. <laughs> god yeah. I actually, you know what's really funny? My yeah. mom had a boyfriend named Douglas, and he looked very much like Douglas Cartland. That's interesting. Yeah, it was super surreal. Uh, my mother actually was dating a guy that looks a lot like Rinji. <laughs> oh no. She was like, oh, see, I knew you liked that guy. Your boyfriend looks just like him. I was like, mom, gross, no. <laughs> God, imagine the, the age difference between you and him, too. Just, ugh. Actually, though, me and my mom are not that far apart in age. 
because she's only 49 right now. Rini, aren't you like in your I'm late 30. 20s? Oh, you're a year older than me. Yeah. That's right. So she's 10 yeah. years older than you? She had me at 19. Okay. So technically not a teen mom. Yeah, technically. <laughs> she, she made it by a couple years. This mark on the mirror looks so familiar somehow. What do I know it from? Where did I once see it? And why does my head hurt so much when I try to remember it? Oh yes, I've mentioned this to Rinny. I have not told you and you folks in the chat about this. I crushed hard on Heather when I was her age. <laughs> I don't know, there's just both appearance and personality just she got me. And the little the little skirt and boots combo is cute. You know what's fun uh, now that you mention it, it makes me it kind of reminds me of Ashley's outfit in Resident Evil 4. I know they actually do look a lot alike. Right, she's just not wearing the sweater, the orange sweater vest. Yeah, Ashley's just a little bit more annoying. <laughs> Honestly, Ashley is like baby Mario. She's only annoying if you're shit at the game. <laughs> yeah. Well, There's that's only helpful. so many Ashley crying that I can take. <laughs> <laughs> Mystic X Mystic, welcome back! Well, yeah. Well, that's helpful. Maybe I should walk around it? Never mind. Who parked this here anyway? Okay, we're not going through that window. Oh, yeah. Thing that is my biggest gripe with this game every fucking door is locked or broken. I hate that. I fucking hate that. Because there is no indication on which ones are and are not, like, uh, are, uh, are accessible. I'm gonna run and go turn on my fan real quick. I will be right back. Alright. Actually, speaking of chat, how is the fan in my room? It's not drowning out or audible over the mic, is it? Oh, we got ourselves a Beretta. Oh, gross. That thing is nasty. We actually have to fight this thing or if it dies in the cutscene. How are you? And I don't uh, think the fan is doing anything. Okay. That's good. That's good then. Because I, I had a few episodes where my fan was audible and it was like. And I had to run it through um, fucking. Aud I had to run the stream's audio through Audacity several times to get it. to get. to get rid of it. It's definitely not human. I've never heard of such an animal. And no way it's a costume. It sounds crazy when you say it, but monster is the only word for it. But I don't think I'm crazy. It's a, a monster. I killed it. Nothing on the shop counter particularly catches my eye. Oh, you know what I just remembered? There's a bulletproof vest around here. Somewhere. Oh, no, wait, that's in the other world. Never mind. Oh, hold the fuck up! We got handgun bullets! Alright, we are in business. There's something very definitive about bullets. You see, lasers could be on low power or it could be on stun. Um, 
electricity, you could always get back up. You never know. But with bullets, you know that's going to leave a mark. Boo! Hello, Rinny. <laughs> Red Vamp Alucard in the chat. Dang it, Twitch. Oh, let me guess. Ads. Ew, it has an own whole face. Yeah, that's oh. by design. <laughs> that is literally what they were aiming for. I was like sweating to death. I had to turn the fan on. It was too hot. <laughs> <sighs> Do um, broken door. Broken door. Oh. He didn't get a notification that she went live. Uh. Nope, again, I'm not being told. Oh. I think that has to do with, like, the amount of people who watch streams when they're live. Um, I know that YouTube has a thing where if your channel does not get enough engagement, they won't tell people when you're going live. Or it could be that they shadow ban you, because that also happens. Though I don't oh, know if really? Twitch... Well, YouTube, it definitely happens. I actually don't know if Twitch shadow bans people or not. I don't know. Ah! I'm surprised I'm not shadow banned. It's though. a fucking frozen chicken on legs! <laughs> Go kiss it. No. <laughs> <laughs> Give him a hug. He's kind of cute. Look at him. Is it weird that I now want a turkey? <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, just do it. And <laughs> no. <laughs> Actually, I shouldn't have wasted bullet on that thing. Um, supplies. Should have knifed him. Okay, 15 rounds of ammunition. I better not waste them on the numb bodies. That's fucking stupid. Waste all your ammo. <laughs> no, I don't think I will. <laughs> no. <laughs> no smoking. Oh yeah, that stein won't stop me because I don't care. Actually, I don't smoke. Omen does. Oh, really? Yeah, Omen smokes a pipe, but I think he's also started smoking cigars. Don't think he smokes cigarettes. Um, if he does, that's it's kind of gay. At least he doesn't vape, though. That's the big gay. That's the big gay oh, right yeah. there. I definitely do not like vaping at all. A frozen chicken on legs quote of the night. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, cool! I can stun lock the doggo! Get him! Oh, he's so gross. Ew. Yeah. The, not as gross as the dog from Silent Hill 4, though. Those things are fucking disgusting. <laughs> oh, um, I don't know how to, like, stream slick Wii games, but I would love to do Shattered Memories. Oh, I got an answer to that. Um, get Ooh. yourself the. D well, actually, depending on. Actually, no, that wouldn't be easy. That one doesn't require too many motion controls. I mean, it might make the chase sequences harder, but then again, um, knocking over the things to stop the monsters was always unreliable. I could definitely do a Shattered memory stream. Let's do it. <laughs> maybe next Halloween. Maybe you and maybe you and me could like stream the Silent Hill games together. Dang it, okay, I'll wait till next Halloween. <laughs> It'll be our special place, just like James and Mary. I'll just uh, make sure. If you start coughing, though, I'm smothering you with a pillow. No. <laughs> so romantic. Oh, God. <laughs> Such a charmer. <laughs> Rini, you've known me for how long? You know that I just say <laughs> off the wall shit because it's funny. Yes, <laughs> that's true. <laughs> I have two settings, a actually charming, and then just off the wall gremlin Wait. out of nowhere because Wait. it's You're funny. You're actually charming since when? <laughs> when I wanna be. <laughs> <laughs> well, maybe that was that might have been too bratty. <laughs> oh my god. Rini, you've called me sweet before. You know. No, you... there's no proof of that. <laughs> 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 Good luck trying to go back through the messages and <laughs> find Oh, uh, where the fuck is where the fuck is the universalist lady? I got I gotta go <laughs> I gotta go chastise her for her heresy and for killing Harry, my boy. Honestly, I am when I saw that when I first saw Silent Hill 3, I was so fucking angry that they killed Harry. Me too. That's probably why I haven't really played it. <laughs> because uh, I, I do too. I really like him, especially because I first played Silent Hill 3. And Harry Mason in Silent Hill 3 is 
like, okay, here's the thing about Harry Mason in Silent Hill 1. He doesn't really have character. He's like Plank from Ed, Ed, and Eddie. He's just there, and you kind of project yourself onto him. Yes, he has character and depth in this game, but Harry from Shattered Memories is the kind of dude, depend like, the way I was playing, he was cracking dad jokes and, like, being completely chill about everything. <laughs> I just really liked Harry in Silent Hill Shared Memories. He's a he's a he's a good dude. And the fact that he was dead in three, I'm like, no! You bastards! <laughs> Not Harry. <laughs> Conversely, I don't hate I don't get why people hate James. Like, yes, he why. at worst he's a selfish dick, and and at best, you know, he was going through some really complicated shit, and I kinda get it. Yeah, but can't really... I don't know, I'm not really one to judge unless I've been in that same situation. <laughs> and I'm like, you know, I don't know what I would do. Uh, yeah. Um, fuck Walter, though. Walter's an asshole. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I get that he's... Dude's got mommy issues, and um, I, I, I get that. I've been there. But that is not an excuse for creating an entire dimension and just going ham on 21 people. Fuck. I forgot how labyrinthian this game could be. Like, I think we're supposed to be here, but I'd swear there's a... Bakery! Yes! Yeah. Ooh, it's bread. bread. <laughs> <laughs> it's bread. I would have never guessed. Thank you. I don't know why that's so fucking funny. <laughs> it's not that funny. Oh my god. <laughs> oh shit, it's so fucking We're losing him, chat. <laughs> <laughs> Hell, Tom's. I like bakeries because oh, they're- Oh, I go pick up the Tom's. <laughs> yes, <laughs> I know, right? As the games got more graphically detailed, the harder it was to find the items you were supposed to pick up. <laughs> <laughs> Can we take a breadstick? <laughs> I don't know. Let's see. I like to. I like to go to the. That's the reason I like to go to the Olive Garden. The breadsticks are free. <laughs> oh my God, Seth, there's donuts. <laughs> oh my God. I must. I must take the. Wait a minute. You're a liar. That's a bagel. No, there's donuts behind you. There's donuts. At least they were round and pink. So they had to be donuts. Oh shit, no, you're right. Donuts. Yeah, look at it. From the depths of the underworld, I summon thee, Donut. If anyone got that, you have my utmost respect. If anyone caught where that it caught that reference. Oh, uh, that was that comes from a very old flash animation called Cactar and Tonberry. Oh. <laughs> Fuck, I'm getting old. And I hate um, it. I think the things that I was doing with the flash games were probably different than what you were doing. <laughs> probably not. <laughs> I just got around to it later rather than sooner. <laughs> I was playing Kitty Catapult. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I take it back. Yeah, no, really, that's that's awful. That's that's fucking vile. <laughs> oh god, I'm just kidding. Even though I have played that game before, I, I have I have two, and I, I I played it for like one. I played like I did like one go because my friends fucking insisted, and I'm like I, I I refused after that. I'm like, guys, this is fucking awful. Come on. Conversely, like the catapult with Rick Astley's too. face was hilarious. Because <laughs> it sings never gonna give you up for as long as his head's rolling. Oh god. See, the thing I was playing was actually really cute. It was called Paladodge, and it was adorable. <laughs> Large Bagel, the fa Fanime. What is that? Fanime? A fan anime. There's oh, a, there's a fan anime about a large bagel. I don't know. I, <laughs> I, she, I think she just might be kidding. <laughs> I, I, I think Chibi's just messing with us. Yeah. I want my bagel. <laughs> I want to get a beagle and name it Bagel. Oh, that'd be cute. <laughs> Wait a minute. What the fuck poster is that? I don't know. Some 
the revolution of... It's just a poster, <laughs> big deal. <laughs> the revolt of Tyran Al. I've seen that from somewhere. What? Does it? <laughs> it says blow dry. <laughs> Why does it say blow dry? Where does it say so blow dry? At the very bottom, unless I'm reading it. Oh my god, no, you're right! What the yeah. fuck? <laughs> Why does it say blow dry? <laughs> <laughs> what is this poster? <laughs> so weird. Goodbye, cursed poster. <laughs> if, if Omen were here, you know he'd make oh, some fucking inappropriate. Silent Hill too. Wait, what Silent Hill? Well, there was a poster that said Silent Hill 2 back there. Oh, cool. Oh, God, it's like inside of it. It's like a... I don't know, it's... Oh. It's like fucking Inception. <laughs> yes, the right... <laughs> like, what is the... Oh, shit, I see it! Holy yeah, right fuck! There. I'm really good at, like, noticing stuff in the background. See, I'm terrible at that. It's probably why um, I lost my job as a coder when I was working for Qualcomm. Well, oh, actually, no. I blame that one entirely on my ADHD medication not being accessible. Because my fucking oh psychiatrist my went incommunicado on me for the better part of fucking three years. There is a bagel waifu! It's real! <laughs> <laughs> Whenever someone says it's real, I can't help but think of that one bit from Doctor Who, The End of Time, where the doctor, like, finally puts his forehead to the master's head and he's like, oh my god, it's real. And the master's like, it's real! It's real! <laughs> it's real! <laughs> oh god. He's almost crying because he's like, oh my, because he's like, I'm not fucking crazy. It's actually there. Man, I wish I could be not crazy, but it's too late. <laughs> what I wouldn't give to not be mentally ill. I have a laundry list of fucking mental disorders, and I fucking hate it. I know what I'm supposed to do with the tongs, I just can't find the fucking room again. <laughs> this is fucking nonsense. I don't know which room you're looking for, so... It's the one where we got the, um... With the save, uh, with the save... It's, it's a storage room with the save emblem, the Halo of the Sun. Yeah, you know that occult, like, red symbol that you saved the game at in this game? Oh, yeah. Oh, God. <laughs> Are you good? <laughs> oh. Why would you do that? This is not the place. Um, really? Sorry. <laughs> oh, we found it! Sorry. Yeah, there we go. And here, this is why we have these. We're gonna tongue it. Oh, it's a key! Yep. You know, actually a cosplay of Heather would be pretty easy to do. Yeah, it would. Um, examine. The tag on the key says, my best seller is the bookstore, that's right. And here we come to the game's first and most notorious puzzle. And the reason this one is so notorious- No! No, 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 you get out of here, you little shit. <laughs> I am not in the mood for frozen chicken. Okay. I had chicken nugger yesterday. I will not eat chicken nugger tonight. <laughs> I have had enough of swear potato and french fried. Uh, you know what, this is gonna be a problem. Oh god, okay, I'm like getting damage for each like damage on them. This is not good. Oh no. No, go away. Okay, I better I better run. This is this is absolutely stupid. How many how much health do we have? Yeah, that went about as poorly as could be expected. <laughs> Uh-oh. Oh god, I just realized something. <laughs> I jokingly talked about, like, suffocating you with a pillow earlier when, uh, in reference to James and Mary, 
And I just realized that would make me six. <laughs> and you never want to be six, Doctor. That guy's a fucking dick. <laughs> Yeah, you're just like, I'm not I'm gonna like, suffocate you, but don't worry about it. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, okay. <laughs> I would never actually suffocate you. Does that make me like the worst companion or the best companion? Because I'd just go along with it. Oh, God. I have no idea how to answer that. <laughs> oh no. Uh, I mean, no, you know what? When I when I thinking about it now, I just imagine that Skeletor meme. You know the one jokes on you! I'm into that shit! <laughs> <laughs> oh I like to be suffocated, Ella. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. Uh, oh, Jesus God. Christ. I can it's like, I can kind of imagine the fan art that would get drawn of us if I actually got fan art from my viewers. <laughs> oh, fuck. Just nobody, please pair me, do, do not pair me with Omen, I beg you, do not do that. I will literally cry. I know people in there shipping. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Dude, that'd be like that'd be like pairing Rose and the Master. Yeah, please don't. <laughs> Hold up. Okay, there's. Okay, so we were partly there. Okay, no, that's a nine. Okay, that one's got nothing on it, so that goes there. Okay, that's a four. That goes. Okay, you go. Stop! Good boy. <laughs> okay, so the answer is 4296. Oh, yay! More handgun rounds. Okay, now this puzzle right here is why nobody plays on um, expert or or hard riddle level difficulty. Because of the fucking... You would need a college education on f um, fucking Shakespeare's plays to, to know how to do that. Now, I've actually done... Oh! It's her! Yeah. Um, White Wolf Gaming. So how are you two holding up? Um, we're we're doing good. We just got to we just got to Claudia, as you can see. Um, we were joking about someone shipping Omen with Rini, and why that would not be good. Chibi in the chat. I'd never pair you with Omen, Rini. If anything, I'd pair you with uh, Asami from Finder. Omen be the UK too. Remind me who Omen is. He's my brother. He shows up in the Dragon Quest streams. Yeah. <laughs> we have banter sometimes, so I was just like, don't, don't do that, guys. Don't do that. <laughs> like, Omen's, Omen's been, in, like, an actual asshole to Rinny before. <laughs> it nearly we, destroyed we, the adventuring party. We moved on, though. Yeah, thankfully. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna... After this cutscene, I'm going to tab out and adjust the volume, because clearly the in-game volume is much lower than the fucking music video for the intro. Wait. How's the audio coming through on your guys' end, chat? Are you guys able to hear the game's audio fine, or do I need to, like, adjust the mixing? White Wolf. Oh, I thought Omen was some character in Silent Hill. Nah, nah. Though I could see why you'd say that. <laughs> this game, it would not be out of place for somebody to be named Omen. No, Omen, like me, is a Time Lord, He, and so he's the Omen. I'm the Arbiter, he's the Omen. Our mother's the Botanist. And, um... Dad has actually agreed to join me on stream tomorrow. Uh, and, and future Saturdays going forward. So you guys might get to meet my dad. I don't remember what ch uh, what title he chose for himself after getting out of the Academy on Gallifrey. Um, but you guys will be finding out in the very near future when we when we do our first stream together. Oh, 
Does that mean you're streaming twice tomorrow then? Technically, yes. Oh. Though we gotta figure out what game to play. Um, Dad said that he doesn't have the time for an MMO, unfortunately, and we used to play that Star Wars um, Old Republic MMO together every Saturday, and then we kind of stopped and fell out of practice, and unfortunately, um, he does not have the time for an MMO, so we I'd have to wait for things to slow down at work for him. Um, if we stream, it'll probably be either Soul Calibur, uh, Payday 2, or something else that we both own that's multiplayer online. How the hell do I get out of here? Well, that's gonna be pretty cute. Yeah, you guys will probably you guys will probably like my dad. My dad's a well, I don't want to say he's a great dude. I mean, he walked out on our uh, on us when I was three, and he did cheat on my mom. But you know, he's chill. And I, he does, he regrets the past mistakes he made. Yeah, people make mistakes. Nobody's perfect. Oh, yes, the elevator. Um, your dad's gonna do a stream with you? Yeah, that's right. Um, play mine, uh, play Miracle Norton, uh, Norton from Tenjimoi. JK, JK, actually, absolute uh, uh, obedience from the same artist. It's translated in English, after all. Radio, where the hell is this do- uh, What the hell is this thing doing falling down uh, from the ceiling? Anyway, I guess that explains the static from just before. But all it's picking up is static. I wonder if it's broken. Aww. Tried to get my dad to do a- to perhaps do a RE gun review because he's a bit of a gun nut. Unfortunately, he keeps um, deciding not interested, sadly. Aw. Uh, that's unfortunate. I, I saw the monster out of the corner of my eye and it looked like a boob. Because <laughs> I was reading the chat. <laughs> These monsters look more fucked up than I remember them looking. Yeah, there's some really creepy ones. <clears throat> you know, uh, my mom is now a YouTuber. Really? Yeah, she makes videos about her truck driving. It's kind of cute. Oh, that does sound kind of nice. I could totally see um, my mom doing garden streams. If she had the, if she, if she had the, oh, no, no, okay, we are not in chill, chill chatting mode anymore, we are in fucking survival mode, this is not good, <laughs> I am being chased by monsters, and it's like, it, all we need now is the fucking Scooby-Doo music, Scooby or ghost, Doo, where are you? <laughs> because, have you ever heard of the, of the band Ghost? Yes. And I, I listened to, like, a few of their songs, and I'm like, oh my god, it is Scooby-Doo chase music. <laughs> Basically. <laughs> I thought that was just like people I thought that was just like a meme people made who didn't like the band made fun of, but I'm like, no wait, that's an accurate description. <laughs> okay, I have no I idea what I picked up. The Scoopy Dude Chase music is always a bop. Usually. Um one of my favorite Oh okay, sweet. I'll call it uh, good, we're back at uh we're back at good health now. Um one of my favorite Scooby-Doo Chase songs is uh, Love the World by Rocky. I think it was in the episode with the Headless Spectre. Hmm, I think I remember that. I actually still occasionally sing it to myself. I actually um, went out of my way to find it and download it to my phone so that I could listen to it whenever. All right, yes, bulletproof vest. Give me that shit. Should be something here, but it's too dark to see. If only I had a flashlight. You dumb blonde. There's a light switch in here somewhere. What the fuck was that? <laughs> the purse fell off of the rack. Right? Shouldn't be too dark to see. 
Where in the blazes do I find the flashlight? Wait a minute, I'm stupid. Nope, wait, we do not have the flashlight yet. Never mind. I am not stupid. This time. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> So, question for you. Do you do all Gallifreyans regenerate, or is it just one that's been having the adventures? Um, yes, actually. Well, here's the thing. All Time Lords can regenerate. Not everyone from Gallifrey is a Time Lord, um, contrary to popular belief. We have what are called Shibogans, and they're the people who were not eligible or did not graduate from the Academy. Um, and they're basically considered common folk. My sister is a Shibogan, in fact. She's not... She's not qualified for the Academy because of her impairment. And that's not me being... That's not... That's not me being flippant. Like, my sister is actually mentally impaired. Which is why I don't have her on streams with me ever. She actually lives in a, uh, a foster home. Aww. Yeah, because unfortunately my sister is... She's both not smart enough to function and too smart for her own good. She has this weird ability to un find unlocked doors or windows and just get the fuck out of wherever she is. She's basically a Houdini. Okay, I cannot find that stupid flashlight for the life of me. This stupid maze. No! No, leave me alone, doggos. You are bad boys. Broken door. No, 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 no. Don't you dare. Um. Okay. I'm hearing howling. I'm assuming that's the game. But we do have coyotes where, um, we, uh, we have coyotes around here, so, could... <laughs> that's, that's not really a coyote howl. Coyote howls yes. are actually very difficult to imitate because they oscillate their voice. Okay, we got a bed with blood on it. That's, we got books. Where the fuck is a flashlight? I know I've forgotten something really important, but I also have the feeling that I'd better and be better off not remembering it. Oh god, that is so red. Oh. <laughs> okay, well at least all the enemy positions reset. The fact that I cannot find this flashlight is driving me fucking nuts. I still remember the first time I ever saw a commercial for this game, though. Um, it just so showed, like, footage of the game, and um, you hear Heather saying, if you're scared while you're lost, just wait till you're found. I can remember... Why, why, can, why is it that I can only remember part of what I need to know? Oh, hold up, we got... No, that's not a bucket that you can pick up, apparently. Room of the Central Square Shopping Center while in the other world, and you have to turn the light off to find it. The storeroom. Okay. The storeroom is located to the left of the woman's restroom on the first floor. Shit. We should be on the first floor right now. I don't think we have a map of this area though. I don't know. I don't remember us getting one. We got one in the normal world, and now that we're in a room without monsters, maps. Perfect. Um, well, we seem to be in the correct place. Look at that. Wait, did you say opposite of the woman's restroom? Uh, it's like to the left of. I think we're in the right room. How do I turn the light off? This is 
is just a romance novel. I can't be bothered with it right now. <laughs> Doesn't look like there's anything useful on the shelf. Yeah, um... What? No! Bad dog! Oh, Renji just farted right next to me. Bro. <laughs> Renji, that's nasty, my dude. <laughs> He's a monster. <laughs> <laughs> Red Van Malakar in the chat just going, Renji! <laughs> nope. Not that way. The storeroom... Oh, I'm I'm an idiot. I'm a big dumb idiot. Uh-oh. <laughs> Because... Broken lock. That door's fine. But that's not the room we need to go to. I think it is... Not this one. Is it this one? That's locked. This is the elevator. It keeps. Pu I keep pushing the button, but the elevator doesn't do anything. Okay. Look at those doggos. They are just chowing down on whatever the fuck that's uh, that is there. Mm. Ah, no! Oh, am I dead? Remarkably, no. Heather is not dead. No, don't you dare. You bad animals. Oh, there it is. Good thing we saved. Oh, shit, it's Valtiel. Dragging it off, dragging her off to revive her. I don't know why, but whenever I see, whenever I play the Silent Hill games, I want pizza. <laughs> it's probably all the red and orange. Ew. I associate those colors with pizza. Ew. My brain is hardwired. <laughs> Eddie, yes. Like yeah. <laughs> How can you just sit there and eat pizza? <laughs> I like watch me. <laughs> <laughs> no! Fuck, I hate dogs. Both in game and in real life. I hate dogs. No, I am not a dog person anymore. It's just because your doggies are bad. I have. I, I am responsible for too many doggies that are not my own, and it is not my job either. Yeah, poor you. My doggie's an angel. I get no why people time. like dogs. I just don't. I am done. I am burned out with dogs. Like, imagine if you knew someone who had up who had more than four cats. I have four cats. <laughs> right, but imagine if you knew someone who had more than four. I want another cat. <laughs> God damn it, Rini. <laughs> They're cute and fluffy. <laughs> I mean, yes, but that's too many. I want ten cats. Rini, no. <laughs> of all the cats. I buy just... them their own house. <laughs> they just have a house for the kids. Oh, am I dead? Okay, I'm not oh, dead, you... surprisingly. Oh, God. Heather, oh, you are in rough shape. Ooh. Yeah. Uh -oh. yeah. <laughs> um, oh, fuck. Wow, that only got us up to yellow with a first aid kit. Holy shit. Okay. I am, I am lost. I am lost, yes. I am not scared while I'm lost, I'm annoyed. I'm very angry. How dare I be lost. <laughs> <laughs> it's 
That sucks being lost. I used to have like an existential fear of being lost when I was little. Oh, can I? Okay, so I have a story. Uh oh. When my dad actually was still with us, he took us all to the park one time, and there was these sand pits, and I liked to go play in them. Right. So I was just sitting in the sand pit playing, and my dad took my siblings and left. What and I the was shit? There in the sand pit all by myself, probably for hours, I'm guessing. And then my mom came back for me. <laughs> he, he never came back. That is fucked I up. Yeah, it was probably a good thing my dad left. Probably. He did not want children. To be fair, neither did my mother, but <laughs> she was kind of stuck with us. I mean... I only learned this relatively recently. I was an accident. So was I. Yeah, accidents. <laughs> I mean, who wants children at 19? Not very many people. Like, I actually wouldn't have minded, like, settling down at 19. But I'm probably an outlier. <laughs> Fuck this stupid room again! There was another room that had that was very much a closet, and I am trying to find it, and the fact that I can't fucking find it is driving me crazy. Oh. We got there uh, so once. Wolfie, the reason this place is like so gross and dirty is because we're technically in the other world right now. Oh! Oh, thank you, God! A place I have not yet been to. Ooh, oh. That camera change. Ah. <laughs> oh, she needs a hanger from the fucking clothing store to get the fucking ladder. Could that be where we needed to turn a light on, maybe? It was. We needed a flashlight to get the hangar and the bulletproof vest. Oh, okay, so, okay, I see. Never mind. Yeah. Hey, um, sausage arms. Go fuck yourself. <laughs> I mean, those arms would be pretty good for that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Rainy. <laughs> You started. <laughs> I did, I did. <laughs> it's, oh, maybe it's a good thing that Rick couldn't join us. <laughs> he would have, he would have bonked us with the... <laughs> he would have hit us with the bonk stick. He was a Seth so disappointedly. <laughs> what, what was that? I was like, he always says Seth in such a disappointed tone. Yeah. <laughs> He's like our little angel on our shoulders. <laughs> the little devil. <laughs> Basically, yeah. Uh, Rick is the guardrails that keep me on the straight and narrow. Omen is the one who wants to tear down all guardrails and just uh, cause absolute fucking chaos. Omen has black <laughs> Air Force energy. I actually wanted to buy him a pair of black Air Force Ones as a Christmas present. And he's like, Seth, no, don't do that. Oh, God. <laughs> Are you I do think it's uh, really cute, though, that he's got his fiance. I don't yeah. think they're married yet, right? Yeah. Yeah, they're, they're... so cute. Yeah, I'm. I, I'm. This is how I. This is another reason I say I'm not a good person. Um, I used to say to myself, "Well, at least my brother can't get a girlfriend either." And then when he did, it's like, "Well, shit! Now I have no excuse." <laughs> Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> oh gosh. It's and you know, I, fairness to myself, it's not that I don't it's not that I've never been in a relationship, it's that they're very far and few between. And I still can't find that fucking door. Relationships take a lot of work. They're hard. They are, yeah. And dating apps are a fucking cancer. Yeah, it's easy if you're a girl, but if you're a guy... Oh! But, uh, we are getting bonks in the chat, no more horny from LCP anime <laughs> guy. <laughs> Bonk. Um, uh, LCP, I swear to god, my mo on my grave... On my grave, I will be the, at the ho- the ho- uh, I will be at the horny <laughs> out of- <laughs> <laughs> with, with the horny shotgun. Okay. Ah, 
really? You're gonna beat me with a shotgun? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why, but I just imagine him using like um beanbag uh shotgun rounds. Are you familiar with those? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking beanbag gun. Fuck, where is that stupid closet? Why can't I find it? This is driving me bonkers. Now I remember why I don't stream the Silent Hill games. Oh, I'm an idiot. Rinny, do you see this? Oh. Yeah. <laughs> I'm hitting the button. <laughs> I'm hitting the button for that one. I'm retarded. <laughs> I, I love that clip so much. Oh my god. <laughs> you know what's really funny? My manager when I worked at the RV park as a security guard um, looked just like that dude who says I'm retarded. <laughs> oh my god. Dang it, if only I had 3,000 points. Why? What's that for? <laughs> <laughs> I've honestly forgotten. It's like, I'm... I'm I'm very bad at keeping up with my chat. Ever heard of the uh, shotgun drum mags for Saga Viper 12 gate and shotgun? Um, maybe. Oh, oh, we got the door, no. ladies and gentlemen. We found it. Woo! Yeah! I do want to learn to uh, actually use a handgun though. I've actually fired a handgun before at a range when I was training to become a security guard. Oh. I just want to get Claire's gun. <laughs> Omen, you should talk to Omen. He actually is making a replica of the, um, re of the Samurai Edge. Oh, I know, because I'm going to have to buy, um, like, buy one that somebody makes for me, so I'm like, dang it. <laughs> but it'll be worth it. See, I want a, um... H and K. Oh God! What the fuck is the gun that was um, Leon's was based off of? I want the Silver Ghost. That thing is cool as shit. Or even like Barry's Magnum would be so good. <laughs> I I'd pass on the mag. Oh, on Barry's Magnum. My favorite oh, Magnum oh, is the Smith and Wesson <laughs> 500. Barry's was a Colt Anaconda, which, to oh, my yeah. knowledge, isn't a real gun. I think it was based off of oh, the Colt man. Python. I could be mistaken though. I don't know. As I, like I said, I don't know a lot about guns. I just know I, I want I want a player's gun. I need it. Oh, uh, is, are you talking about Claire's gun from the remake or the original? Original. Oh, okay. Claire's revolver in the remake looks so weird. Yeah, I don't know why they did that. <laughs> I mean, I like the upgraded cool. version of it, because it looks kind of cool, but the default is just, what the fuck is that frame? I think they are Beretta M9s, but like... Yeah, the Samurai Edge was a variant special. of the Beretta 92, um, with with some like custom work done. And I need to find the uh, place with the doors. Nope, not that one. Uh, yeah, the reason that me and Seth are friends is because we both love Resident Evil. <laughs> yeah, one of the first uh, one of the first times I flirted with Rini, I quoted Leon. <laughs> <laughs> that is true. And then I was like, "Oh, hey, Doctor Who," and then he like lost his shit. Yeah. <laughs> oh god. What the fuck was that noise? I don't know, you should go poke it. Wait, what? They weren't like this before, what could have happened? Heather, are you not gonna comment on how the fucking... Okay, you know what? I'm gonna do it again. I'm gonna do it again. <laughs> okay, yeah, no. It's this stupid fucking purse. Heather, wh why? Just, just examine the purse. It fell off the rack. It's gotta be important, right? Examine the fucking purse. Fine. Be be stupid. I don't care anymore. <laughs> Stab the purse. I'm gonna, sh I'm gonna shank the monsters. Um, items, <laughs> supplies. Better use one of these. There we go. 
Sa you want to save your ampules for the boss fight with God. Well, the devil, I'm going to call it. Because that's not... Ah, fuck you, dick arms. <laughs> Edward Dinka's <laughs> hands. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> That's what it is. <laughs> Blocks. Okay, we gotta find a map. Oh, um, a donkey! Oh, okay, I see where it is. I know where we go. My dog's sitting on the couch like a human. Looks, ju Leon's just an HK USP. Is it though? Yeah, no, I think you're right. It's a it's a very modified HK USP. I was um I was Leon S Kennedy for Halloween in high school one year. Aww. And um one of the girls saw me. It was like, "No, you are not cool enough to be Leon." I'm like, "I'm Leon anyways." Oh, that's so mean. <laughs> yeah. But I didn't really let it bother me. I was like, "I don't care. I'm Leon anyways, bitch." <laughs> Okay. No, go away. Edward Dingus hands. This is not, no. Just stop. Locks oh, locks broken. Okay, I think it's <laughs> this one over here. Yeah, here we go. Nope, nope, wrong door. Oh, uh, Mari thinks I'm cool. <laughs> um, uh, uh, Mari? Yeah, let's go. <laughs> Seth, when he was flirting with Rini, I forgot about our date, a senior moment, perhaps, but I'm, even, uh, but I'm not even 25 yet. <laughs> yes, that is actually me, anime guy. I am, um, I, I sometimes worry that I have dementia because of how bad my ADHD is, even when I'm medicated for it. That's not what I wanted to do. Here we go. Oh, God! What's wrong with Heather? Oh, Heather? <laughs> she has become an abomination just like everything else in this dimension. Heather, the inside of you is so cute. Oh, God! She's she's become the grit, the glitch gremlin. <laughs> the, a the glitch gremlin from the AV Genesis show. Wait, what? <laughs> oh, God, her character model is completely fucked. Uh, okay. Oh, no. We're going... Uh, I'm, I'm going to do this. I'm going into options. I need to see if there's something I fucked up. Um, English, brightness, video, sterile, no, control type. Um, uh, extra <laughs> options, normal, normal, normal. Much. The glitch gremlin from the glitch realm. <laughs> what? No, no, don't do this to me. Oh, what'd you do? Okay. Subtitles off. That's good. Blood. Uh, little normal. Map zoom. Okay. Um, resolution. Oh. Oh. Okay. I don't care. <laughs> oh, look at that. Heather's. Um. I don't know. She's beautiful. Um, I can't tell if that's better or worse. A little better. Oh god, there's like her legs. What? What the hell's going on? <laughs> this is so cursed. Heather, you're so beautiful. Look at your, I, your I have transformed. Or no? Um, I, I I was trying to give you guys an adventure with the Arbiter, but this has turned into a Vine Sauce Corruptions video. We have accidentally corrupted the game files of Silent Hill 3. I've never seen this before. I don't even know how you did it. I don't either! I wish I knew, because then I could undo it. <laughs> yes, um, Speen, that is, you've got the right idea, um, Strogmari. Oh god. Um... I, and a BB gun, uh, there for the M9s. I think it's just, uh, uh, Rini, you know, I think otherwise, um, Glitch Gremlin uh, come from the Glitch Realm, from the legendary lands of Glitchius Speen, yes. <laughs> God, it's like, it, oh, wait, is it better? No, no, it's still oh, just as bad. God. Okay, um, what is wrong with her polygons? <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna try and go into the options. 
If only it had made her boobs pointy, that would have been funny. <laughs> that would have been funny. <laughs> I want to do a pointy boobed Laura Croft cosplay. Yes! Oh, somebody found the... <laughs> the shoes fit perfectly. Uh, I was wondering oh. when somebody would redeem that. <laughs> that actually worked perfectly. <laughs> Um, I forget, Rene, did you ever watch the Doctor Who TV movie? Uh, no, not yet. Okay, then that, you know, um, that's, that's what that quote is from, where Eight is like, um, he's like, oh yes, these shoes, they fit perfectly, just after kissing, um, his assistant in the TV movie. Ooh. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> Yes! Yes, we are good to go, ladies and gentlemen! Yeah! Take that, Glitch Gremlin. And, um, Jesus, I don't know if you... I, I, I don't know, but if you if you do computers, but please, just let this not be infect my machine. <laughs> I mean, it shouldn't, but I, I really don't know where that... Actually, I think I do know where that rootkit came from, so you know what, never mind. We should be good. I'll run, like, ESET just to be safe afterwards. And if weird shit happens, I'll run Tron. I love how I can just, like, run Tron script and not be afraid of viruses anymore, even, like, really shitty ones. Well, except for ransomware. That one, you better hope you have a backup. Oh, you think you're big and scary, monster? I got something way more powerful than any Silent Hill Black Magic. I got Circle Strafing, motherfucker. And a dragon. <laughs> yes, best girl returns. And guess what? I unfucked the polygons. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, you did. <laughs> I uh, I downloaded the files from the PC gaming wiki and just threw them back into the game's directory, and uh, reset everything to default. Hard to believe it's only 10.58. It feels so much later than that. I know. I am a wired boy. I can't... Honestly, <laughs> I've, I've got something exciting planned, though, after I finish the arc that comes after finishing Dragon Quest. Because once, once I complete the arc after Dragon Quest, which is going to consist of three, maybe four games... Um, I'm going to de debut my adult, mo adult model of this incarnation officially. The updated one. Oh, that's different. Something's written here in the same color of red. Piling up 300th day and night from beyond the door, cries of pain are heard. And the final destination has become real, though not a blessed beginning. Any, um, Mystic X Mystic Best Girl is back. Um, I am back. Yes. <laughs> but this is super weird. We got this room that leads to nothing. I'm I'm confused here. Maps. Um I guess we're going down again. Maybe we're supposed to go down from that other floor? I don't know. I don't think we're supposed to be up here right now though cuz every door is locked. 
Oh yeah, there's an interesting mechanic about this game. Um, if you're playing through your first save file, you are locked into the good ending. But in subsequent playthroughs, if you kill too many monsters, you actually get the bad ending. Um, that's gonna kill me, isn't it? Yeah, no. No thanks. Rini, are you are you still there? Yeah. I muted myself uh, and I forgot. No. Oh. <laughs> We've all been there before. <laughs> what I usually do, like every stream. Wait a minute. There was a nice silver ring here the last time I came. Bummer that it's gone, huh? Walnut! And I need to go to find the vice. Um, the radio be acting up. Elevator still. Run Even the call button doesn't work. Oh, yes. Yep, it's a closer. Fuck that. Nope, no, 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 no. Bad demon. That door's fucked. Is this door fucked? Yes, this door is also fucked. No, why are they all fucked? <laughs> Actually, dumb question. Edward Dingus hands over here probably did it. <laughs> that is not... Well, going back the way I came is not solving the problem. Um... That's broken too, apparently. Um, wait a minute. Okay, we down one. So, locked, locked, broken. There's two doors we haven't tried. Nope, that one's also busted. And we're facing one now. Nope, that's also f busted. I guess we need to... How did we bust the walnut? Like, I know how. I'm trying to remember where. Wait a minute. Why would something like this be here? It's not a hospital. Yeah, my thoughts exactly, Heather. Yeah, that is really weird. <laughs> And, uh, this TV... Oh! Oh. <laughs> I can't see anything. I can't hear anything. What was that, I wonder? Did that girl just say, Daddy? Yes, Heather. The subtitles were right there. Oh, great, it's the chickens again. <laughs> Look, I'm, I, th there's been enough cock in this video. We don't need more. <laughs> oh, hold up. No, you fuck off, you little shits. Um, yeah, items. <laughs> Probably. Ooh, bullets and a health drink. Okay, that's good. That's good, I like that. It's unlocked. Yes! We are in business! Wait, why are we back here? Fuck me. Are you kidding me right now? I went through a room of chickens, and I get this. I don't like it. The annoying thing is Silent Hill 3 is not a long game if you know what you're doing and where to go. Unfortunately, yeah, I don't. I thought I did. So now my brother said the fastest time somebody beat this game is three hours and so many and how many minutes? I think that's forty-five minutes. Oh, forty-five minutes. That's it. Yeah, that's the fastest time. That's fast as fuck, right boy. Now. Yeah. 
<laughs> yeah, and if I... I mean, I could jump into the abyss. I mean, that's the solution in Shattered Memories to one of the... to one of the uh, other worlds. But, uh, not really here. That'd just kill us. Yeah, we don't want to do that. <laughs> There is back the way we came. Actually, that wouldn't accomplish much either. I really don't know. Um, okay, correct me if I'm wrong, but aren't there like three alternate worlds here? The other world, the normal one, and like the hell dimension? Sort of. There's the other world, there's the real world, and then there's the other world that Walter created by performing the Ten Hearts ritual which only he can access and the people he plans on killing. Um, and the Order themselves say that it's a blasphemous abomination against God and man. Oh! Thank you for the follow! I don't know who that is. It's not saying in the bot. Um, I've got to redo my bots. I have no idea why they only say some things and not others. Also, how are the sound alerts coming through for you guys in the chat? Can you hear them when they play? Because there's supposed to be the sound of the doors opening on the, in addition to the animation. I'm the new follow. I was just doing it before I forget. Well, thank you for the follow, White Wolf. Glad to have you with us. Oh, I got whacked in the face by a dong. That's just how this day is going. Why? Why must I, I? The thing is, I know where the key is. It's inside the stupid ass walnut. And I know how to open the walnut too. There's a vice that we gotta put it under to crush it to get it to open. The thing is, I don't remember where that is at all. I'm pretty sure that's how every day is in Silent Hill. <laughs> it's a dog to the face. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> getting, getting dick slapped by the other world is a pretty good summary of uh, how Silent Hill be. <laughs> oh, <God. laughs> this, is, this, is, this is turning into a tofu stream. Freaking uh, killer tofu talking about dicks all the time. <laughs> <laughs> Like, I am, uh, I, I kind of tread the line between Saizo and Lude. Although, Re Rick, like I said, Rick is the one who makes sure I stay Saizo. Um, but Tofu, Tofu, he's got no guardrails. He's just like, dicks, dicks, dicks. <laughs> just like George Carlin. Yeah. And I'm really not as lewd as you guys make me out to be. Yeah, no, we, I exaggerate I for comedic effect. Yeah. Um. Oh, you know what? I'm dumb. I'm really dumb. And I'm dumb because I'm pretty sure that the vice to crush the walnut is in the storeroom. <laughs> Wait, no, that's the phone booth, which means that this way is... Well, that's the door. Can I safely look at the map, or am I gonna get jumped by the dong monsters? Oh yeah, okay. Here we go. Whoop, green. What was that? Did you did you hear the crumbling sound effect? Yes. Wait a minute, where the fuck is the light switch? Um... Okay, this is not where the vice is. I'm going to tab out and just Google it, because fuck it. Yeah, <laughs> might as well. How to bust the nut? Wait, no. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. <laughs> mm. 
walnut silent hill wiki um, the walnut is a potato that can be found in the walnut in display case in the jewelry shop the other world uh, the walnut does not provide any uses as it must be cracked opening of vice um, in inside is a moonstone which is used to unlock the door to the split worm well, where the fuck is the vice Um, first floor escalator, second floor watch out for the cudgel, swing, and the zombie dogs, the, uh, yeah we already dealt with that, um, restaurant, so we need to go to the restaurant, cause apparently I'm an idiot, oh great, not, uh, not again. I'm just going to save us some time, exit it out, and uh, now I remember why I do not tab out of Silent Hill 3, because then, windowed, and it looks ugly. Yeah, I hate when games do that. Alright, booting it back up. Man, this is going to be fun to edit. <laughs> <laughs> and I say that with the most sarcasm possible. <laughs> I am not looking forward to editing this. I think this might be the second most, like, extensively- OW! MY FUCKING EARS! Thanks, Akira- uh, Akira Yamaoka. Real nice. Actually, I should thank the people who mixed the sound, not the composers. Okay. We have our walnut, I think, right? Yes. And we know where we're supposed to go now. Second floor. Map. Wait, we're on the second floor. Because hmm. you need to get to the central area to get to the restaurant. And to do that... No! No, I don't like that noise! It can have it. It can have that floor. No. Oh, no, not you guys again. Um... Where the... Fuck. Okay, so yeah, we have to go to the third floor and third floor ladies restroom. I'm very confused right now. Renee, did you accidentally mute again? No, I was just listening. Oh. <laughs> I'm surprised you didn't really have a ah! Where are you? And like, uh, you remember how I've been sick for like freaking months now? Oh yeah, are you are you not feeling great? My throat is like it won't get better, and I don't understand why. Aww, that <laughs> really sucks. So you might have heard me like clear my throat a lot. Okay. What? I'm trying to reach when I have to. Okay. I'm pretty sure that's how every- oh, I've- I already read that. <laughs> yeah, and poor Renji is even more sick than I am, so I'm like, dang. Oh, that's gotta be rough. This is super weird. I get the feeling that there's supposed to be something here, but it's just an empty- I just tapped out again, didn't I? Fuck. Uh, no. Okay. Oh, that's funny, you can fast walk with your weapon readied. Oh. 
We have progress, ladies and gentlemen. You love to see... <laughs> well, I don't love to see that. I don't like dogs, but that's just wrong. Oh, no. What is this? Barbecue dog? Who the hell would make something like this? The Chinese. <laughs> Furthermore, who the hell would eat it? Again, the Chinese. Oh, my it's something Bring in the it. dog's stomach. I gotta cook oh. the key. Ew. You know what? I'm hitting the button again. Cause I'm an idiot. <laughs> we, we tried every door on this floor except for this one. I'm retarded. <laughs> Health drink and a first aid kit. Score. Yeah, teriyaki dog. <laughs> BBQ dog, don't you mean teriyaki? What did I just watch? <laughs> that is the clip I have for when I am a dumbass and don't realize something that should be obvious. Oh or I overlook a solution to a puzzle that should be obvious. The cooked key, I think, gets us into the um, room on the second floor that we couldn't get into that's locked, yeah. and that has the vice in it. Yeah. Or, um... And yeah, you might be wondering why I haven't used the handgun throughout this entire Otherworld segment, and why I've been sticking to the knife. Well, that's because the handgun is really best saved for the split worm. Seth, who's BBQ a dog? Everyone commies like the Chinese. Seth, who's uh, <laughs> such a thing? Everyone, everyone again. The commies like the Chinese. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> There's actually a lot of countries that eat like dog. I know that people started eating cats and dogs in Venezuela when shit was going to hell. I wonder how Venezuela is doing these days. I can't imagine it's gotten any better. I don't know. What would Seth and Rini's kids look like? Hey, humans with dragon wings or very scaly humans? <laughs> I mean, we might be the reason that the Silurians are a thing. You never know. <laughs> oh, steel, uh, rusty pipe instead of a, uh, of a knife. Let's fucking do this. Guys, I, uh, I didn't tell you guys something. If you touch me, I get pregnant. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I know you're trying to be funny, but I've, I've actually, no, I've, um, I knew some evangelicals believed that hand-holding got people pregnant. No joke. And I- they, they were just the most insufferable motherfuckers I've ever met. Oh god. Oh, hydrogen no. peroxide, I think. Cause I don't know if this is like, a hot take or not, but if you just teach, like, children about sex, well, I would say not children, but teenagers. Well, yeah, that's what I, that's what I mean. I like teaching, well, like... Well, elements. be careful, Rennie, because there are people who will, like, say that and actually mean, and actually don't mean teenagers. There's, there's some, there's some really greasy people out there. Oh, no, you don't know shit. <laughs> Yeah, you're not so tough now! Okay, now, I'm hearing evil noises, and I can't hear anyone else. Um, this is not good. My ears are being assaulted, so I have probably committed some cardinal sin against the game. Ah. Why is this game's audio mixing so atrociously bad? Okay, thank god, it's over. I can actually hear myself think. I think though, once you hit- like, once you're like at our age, if you can look at a teenager and not like think of them as a child, you should maybe like- Be worried. Yeah, be a little bit worried about yourself. 
I look at teenagers as teenagers. They're not really kids anymore, but they're not adults either. Yeah, I think that was between. It was a horrible place to be. It really is. Teenager, being a teenager fucking sucked, especially for me, because I was expecting to, I was expected to act my age when nothing was considered age appropriate. <laughs> they want you to talk. Yeah, it was, it, it was fucking hell. I did not like it. <laughs> I don't think anyone does. I think we just do it because we literally have no other choice. Kind of like dying. Well, I mean, you humans. Well, actually, no. Even as time lords, we only get so many. We only get so many regenerations. Unless you. Actually, I'm probably. I do have. Um, I do have an arc planned in the very distant future. Where I basically go on a quest to, like, extend my ability to regenerate. Interesting. Omen, Omen's a, Omen's a dirty, he, he's a dirty lad. He is going to just body snatch until, uh, uh and that's, that's his solution to that problem. Where the fuck is a door?! This the, yeah, I think this might actually be the door I was looking for. Yeah, I did it. <laughs> <laughs> this is why reading is best girl. Wait, no, we've been here before. No, I didn't do this. <laughs> um. Okay, well that answers that. This is the right way. It's just that everything in this stupid fucking hell mall looks the same. It does. Doors, a lot of them are all different. Oh, yeah, remember how I was saying that you need to make chloramine gas? This is it here. Oh. We need a bucket. We have a bottle of ammonia, I think. Yeah, detergent. Um. The bottle says danger, do not mix. Well, I'm gonna be a. What, um, can the can it, can the doctor? No, the doctor can have children. I forgot. <laughs> well, the, the the show's lore about that is very very strange, because Gallifrey can't have uh, Gallifreyans can't have children due to a curse that was put on them during the founding of their civilization. Um, oh. so they have to loom new Gallifreyans essentially. But somehow the doctor has a granddaughter and has had children of his own before. So I really don't know how that works. I like I never actually got that far. I just knew he had like a daughter or something. These people were freaking out when I was like, oh. <laughs> oh yes, Jenny. I actually crushed on her when I was a teenager too. Cause I, uh, I think I've said this before, but I was so kind of broken. Oh, I was, I knew it was inevitable. I was, I'm like, okay, I'll give this new guy a chance. And, um, I didn't like him at first, but then he mellowed the fuck out when Amy and Rory left. And I actually liked him a lot more afterwards. <laughs> um, and I liked Clara for a bit, but the problem is Stephen Moffat doesn't know how to let go of his characters and let them die. Oh yeah, funny thing about the actress who played the Doctor's daughter in that episode, uh, she's actually married to David Tennant. Oh, I didn't know that. Yeah, and she's also the fifth Doctor's granddaughter. Um, the EP is kicking my ass. Hope the rest of your stream goes well. Yeah, we're, we, I had hoped to get much farther than we currently are in this game. I want to at least get out of the mall by the end of this stream. Um, map. Okay, um. 
I wanna ta- I wanna look- Rini, I have a favor to ask of you. Could you do me a favor and look up, like, a text walkthrough to help guide me on where I'm supposed to go? Yes. Thank you. <laughs> um, we've- we've come to the puzzle with the, um, with the detergent and the moths. I know we need a bottle of bleach and a bucket, but I don't know where to get them. Wasn't there a bucket in the room, or was that not one we could use? It wouldn't let me pick it up. Oh, damn it, because there was a bucket just sitting in there. Wait, what What room? Oh, that, the room with the mothy thingies. Didn't you see that bucket in there? No, I didn't see it. Yeah, I just I just assumed that was the bucket. I don't know. It might have just been a bucket in there, though. Oh, there's a... Is the detergent the bleach? No, that would just be detergent, right? Yeah, it's just detergent. Its thing. Bleach is its own it thing. Says... The bleach will be in the woman's bathroom on 1F. Oh! Okay. Yeah, I'm, I'm normal, okay. I know where we are then. I know where we need to go. Renji, stop sniffing the bleach. Renji, you're gonna you're gonna give yourself chlorine poisoning, my dude. <laughs> Like, if you want to fuck around, okay, just don't be shocked when you find out. <laughs> oh. Um, you just said it before I could get the type of Seth Lull. I love bleach. Uh, you can find it on anime tubes. What? Yeah, he, meant the, he meant the anime bleach, but I was being a brat. Oh. Uh, <laughs> No, you fucking don't, you little shit! I am Conan! I'd say we'd make ourselves some chicken dinner, but that looks fucking rotten. Ow! Oh. There we go. Okay, now we should be able to leave this clothing store and then go down to the first floor by do, by jumping through the hole over here. Mr. Castanic has disappeared. Maybe they're wearing a perception filter. You know, I don't even know what my lurk message is. I think I like did just something generic. <laughs> yeah. Oh, are there are there more of them now? I swear there wasn't that many there last time. Again with that crumbling noise. Ladies' restroom. That is not bleach. I'm trying to tell us something. Wait, this is the storeroom. Yeah, I was gonna say we're <laughs> It's full of filthy muddy water. Looks like there's something should you remove the blockage. Yes. Yes. Oh get it. This is way too <laughs> gross. <laughs> <laughs> Who would even think of doing something so disgusting? <laughs> Do you know what's really <laughs> funny about that cutscene? Under normal circumstances, that only plays... That easter egg is only available if you have save data on your memory card from Silent Hill 2. Oh, I didn't know that. Yeah, because James reaches into a toilet in that game and just does it. He's no hesitation. Get bent, you stupid monster. That's right, get stun locked. You're going down.
I am a barbarian! You will all be subject to lead poisoning! I'm a man and a half! Oh, okay, you know what? No, no. I got overconfident. I was getting ready to go full fucking Doom Slayer, and they and they very and the monsters taught me an important lesson in humility. Yeah, they did. <laughs> I gotta say, it's nice that all the scuff has been taken care of now. Yeah, it's good once you finally get past it. Yeah, I was I was not gonna lie, I was actually very scared that this stream was gonna have to get canceled. Um. <laughs> In, again with that stupid fucking dog. Where are you? Bad doggy. Oh, right, okay. And then we... No. So we'll probably have to do this, um... We'll probably have to play this game in, like, several episodes. It's probably not gonna be just two. Yeah. Unless we wanted to marathon it the entire night, but I wouldn't subject that to I wouldn't subject you to that unless you really wanted to. Uh, <laughs> I don't know if I could stay up that long. Yeah, I I it wouldn't be good for my health either to do that. Yeah, you need your sleep. You have a lot going on. Yeah. Although thankfully my schedule is a bit more lenient on the weekend. Maybe Friday uh, and Sat maybe Friday and Saturday evenings will be our game night. Kind of like how Wednesday night it's me, you, and Omen, and uh, and Rick. Yeah. <laughs> well, fuck me. Now I don't know where to find where to go for the uh, moth hallway. Um. Okay, so it's not the f it's somewhere on the second floor. So what's my health at? Orange? Okay. Supplies. One, five. There we go. Um, map. The problem with this place is everything looks the same. I'm sure that was deliberate, too. Probably. You know what's, uh, kind of weird? There is a tra- there is a, uh, tram station that's not really near where I live, it's in the same city as where I live, and it looks just like the subway from Silent Hill 3 in some spots. It's really eerie. And, uh, yes, I did have to commute on that thing in the evening back when I was working in security. That is spooky. Very spooky, yes. <laughs> oh, like bucket! It's empty. Okay, well, um, items... <coughs> This is gonna be really fucking retarded. Okay, yeah, that's all well and good. So 
some insecticide would do the trick. I mean, yeah. <laughs> you guys see that bucket right there? Is that like just... That, uh, is oh, that uh, a garbage, maybe? I don't know. Does it look like it was a bucket, but maybe it's just a really tiny garbage can? Uh, I'm gonna combine the two things and see what happens. I might have been, like, too big brain that I was dumb brain. <laughs> oh, yeah, no, here we go. Oh, cool, okay. <laughs> Heather, you dumbass! You breathe that in! What? <laughs> She's like, it's fine, it's fine. <laughs> Alright, and then, um, fan switches off. And then we're just gonna take a step back or two. Let's. And the question is did it work? Yeah, look at all the dead moths. Y'all can eat shit instead of me or my clothes. Moths are actually pretty cute, though. I know. I've I've met at least like two VTubers who were moths, moth girls. Yeah. <laughs> um, four buttons. Uh. I don't know if they're married or their boyfriend and girlfriend or what, um, but Four Button, he's another VTuber, and his uh, significant other is a moth VTuber. Aww. Yeah, I, I refer to her as Moth Friend. That's cute. Whenever I uh, whenever I show up in Four Button's chat, I always post love Four Button, love Moth Friend, love to shit post, hate normies, simple as, because they're British. <laughs> oh. <laughs> and um. That that they that came from like one day somebody was just um was just randomly talking about how funny it would be if somebody made like a uh, a copy pasta of that one meme uh, North FC if you've ever seen that where the hell am I going okay that's kind of strange I'm heading the right way apparently. Did you ever play the uh, mobile game Silent Hill The Escape? Yeah, that was okay. Whoa! Okay. Oh, of course. Why are my ears getting sandpaper? This is awful. No, go away, you pendulum. This is not the time for that. No, it's not the time for raping my ears. That comes never. <laughs> oh, thank God, another save point. Yeah. Oh, gosh. Wait, what? In the middle of the platform is some kind of vice. Yes! Ladies and gentlemen. What do you mean you can't use it in here? Heather, it's a vice. I will fucking end you. <laughs> Use the fucking walnut. Thank you. And now we can get to the fucking splits and worm. And we will be able to leave this godforsaken mall. Whoa. At least I'm pretty sure it's God forsaken. I mean, look at this place. It looks like hell. Ah, oh, God. The audio mixing in this game is terrible. I hate it. I hate everything about it. Because everyone's voices are... Wait a minute. I'm an idiot. Options. Um, sound. Oh, no. No, you've got to be kidding me. Fuck. There is no voice option. 
There's only background and sound effect options. That's mean. chicken. I can hear you walking. Ow, that's on me. Good thing we have that bulletproof vest on. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I just realized something awful. Those numb bodies, they look like they're um, suffering from harlequin ichthyosis. Are you familiar with that? No. Okay, well, don't be. That's, um... If you know, you know, and you're better off not knowing. No, like, I'm not kidding. It's... Are you familiar with thalidomide? And, um, what that ended up causing? Like, a bunch of, like, really terrible birth defects? Oh, jeez, no. Yeah, no. Um, Harlequin Baby Syndrome is almost as upsetting as thalidomide... Uh, as the thal thalidomide birth defects. It's not something I would recommend looking at. Oh, you know what I just realized? We should probably save the game. Because we're gonna go fight a boss. Ugh, oh, that piercing red light. An hour and 19 minutes. Better players have finished the game by this point. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, they, they practice a lot to get to that point. True. And they have little notes and stuff everywhere, too. Do they really? Yeah, to, to practice, to practice and practice, and they'll have notes. Because I actually am I'm friends with a uh, speedrunner, and he's really good. Interesting. I actually... He, uh, nothing against your friend. I actually hate speedrunners and the concept of speedrunning in general. I think it's pretty cool. Um, I think I'd only do it if I have seen everything to see in the game. I just think it's a very soulless way to play a video game. It's really, they're just, you know, short. Yeah. <laughs> there is one video game I might try to speedrun. Um, I actually streamed it, and I'm, that's one of the ones that I might actually remake because the audio in that was terribly mixed and I wasn't capturing the emulator's audio correctly. It was actually the first video game I ever played and beat, and it was also the first game I ever co-opted alongside my dad. Aww. Yeah. My dad actually wrote a review of it um, about a year before we reconnected, and he was, and, um, in the review he mentioned how special it was to him, because it was the first game he co-opted with someone very important to him. Didn't say who, but, um, uh, but he also, towards the end he says, I hope that maybe I'll be able to see that person again someday. Aww. Yeah, that was, when I saw that, I choked up a bit, I'm not gonna lie. You know what I just realized, Rinny? The demons what? in Infernax, which is the game that me and Rick were playing, all looked like dicks. And then in this game, all of the demons look like dicks. Why is it all dicks? 
Why is it like <laughs> You know that meme of the astronauts? Wait, it's all it's all this, that, or the other thing, and the other guy says always has been. I just imagine like I get to hell and I'm like, wait a minute, it's all dicks, and the devil just laughs, always has been! <laughs> I'm a man and a half! You ain't shit, demon! Except it's still a dick. <laughs> Were your parents divorced? Jesus Christ, that noise. I already have the tinnitus and don't need the t <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> and uh, to answer your question, LCP anime guy, yes. Yes, they were. You know what's funny about this? In, um... Silent Hill Shattered Memories is supposed to be a standalone game, a what-if. It's not really part of the main continuity. But you do end up in a mall, and, um, Heather just randomly st or Cheryl actually randomly stabs someone at the mall, depending on how you play the game. It's one of the things that you can end up picking up on, the ra on like, um, one of those ghost radio things. Um... It's not guaranteed that that's what happened, um, but it's one of the possibilities that she, that Heather like stabbed someone as she was robbing a store. That's interesting. Yeah, um, I'm not a fan of the idea of the entire game being in someone's head, I, especially in the horror genre. Now, if it's like a fantasy series or an isekai, I have a little bit more patience for that. Um, I, I think, like, I'm one of the few people who will defend it being done in the Drawn to Life games as the original ending, but I don't like, I, I hate it in horror games because I think it's a cheap-ass cop-out. It's the reason that I absolutely hate Realms of the Haunting, um, obscure PC game from, like, the 90s, if anyone, if you're unfamiliar, um, because the... The story is this huge play. It starts out spooky, almost like Alone in the Dark meets Resident Evil. And then it goes into like a fantasy setting almost. And then the ending is the mansion blows up, and then you find out everything took place in the main character's head. And he's locked in an asylum somewhere. And the villain was the doctor. And I'm like, you know what, game? Fuck you. You almost stuck the landing on the ending, and then you went and did this. Where the hell's the exit? Uh, eh. What's that? I accidentally clicked my uh, mod stuff and I'm like, oh, I didn't mean to do that. Oh no. <laughs> I'm not, I don't need to mod anybody right now. Uh oh. <laughs> I forget, did I make you a mod in my, um, uh, uh, for the, uh, for the chat? Yeah, I got the sword and everything. Okay, good, good. Woo! Free at last from this accursed mall! Heather! <laughs> it's you. What just happened? Thankfully, though, I only have You really must be one of them! So like what did I do? <laughs> what do you mean by one of them? You're in on this with that Claudia, aren't you? Claudia? What about her? She asked me to find you, that's all. So you are one of them. Claudia did all 
Well, Titus. Oh no. Um, eleven Titus. I don't know what that I is. I was just hired to find you. <laughs> no, oh, I get it. It's a fun. I, I already yeah, got the ten Titus. Don't need the eleven Titus. <laughs> I got four ads. Start? You, the, Mar you the Marvels. What fuck happened up. to you? Yeah, I really wish that I could figure out how to get Twitch to stop being idiotic with the ads. Because people who are subscribed to me are not supposed to get ads, but Rick is subscribed to me on Twitch, and he still gets ads. I think Twitch just doesn't give a shit. Maybe you're just an innocent bystander, but I can't feel sorry for you because you dragged me into this. Oh yeah, Rinny, I, um, I forget. Are you, f are you like fond of VTuber lore? What's so special about you anyway? Ah. Uh, if I knew that, I've actually I been be so confused, would I? I've actually like written down the games I've played through the Let's Plays from the perspective of them being adventures that I've had, essentially. Oh, that's actually Yeah. I've been running from and forgot for a long time. I would love to have like a wiki for my for my streams, but I'm like I don't have the time to create a wiki. What's wrong? Because I know that some I know that some VTubers do have wikis, but they usually they have like really dedicated fan bases, and they're like way bigger than me. What should I? They probably pay people to maintain their wikis for them. I would have I'm because I'm a one man operation. I would probably have to do that myself. Technically, two-man operation because Rick is my co-host, and I mean, I consider you a co-host. Would, would you say you're a co-host or more of a guest star? Hmm. Probably. Well, I think right now, definitely a co-host. What is the four of us though? Probably more of like a guest star. Ah. More probably just because I don't talk as much during those ones. <laughs> yeah, that's true. I think that I think we all kind of try to balance out between talking and letting everyone else talk, and I've noticed that yeah. you tend to let everyone else talk and don't really try to like interject I'm, all that much. I'm bad when there's other people talking. I like I always had it like pounded and <laughs> don't don't yeah. like, talk when other people are talking, and I'm so it's hard for me to speak up when things are going on. Yeah, I'm not good in groups of multiple people. I used to be even worse about it. Um, cause I was, my mom would just, like, really get on my case if I talked over other people. Whereas when I was with my friends, I'm like, nobody really cared. We talked over each other all the time. Um, yeah. <laughs> and me moving out really helped with that and being in, being out of that environment. Cause it's like, that's really a mom problem. That's not a me problem. <laughs> I am a menace, a menace to society. <laughs> Rini is just walking there in place menacingly. <laughs> Man, I wish I could save state. That's the one disadvantage of playing a PC port. Although I gotta admit, this game looks way better than if I had been emulating it on a PS2. I cannot deny that. Yeah, it definitely looks good. Especially now that she's not all weird anymore. <laughs> That would have been pretty fun if we played through the whole thing with her all weird. You know what's really funny? When I first discovered emulation and that there was a PS2 emulator, I tried to emulate the PS2 and play Silent Hill 3 on my uh, HP Pavilion G6, and the frames were so low that everyone sounded like they were drunk and were slurring their words because of how slow they were talking. <laughs> Unfortunately, I cannot. I, it's like it'd be really funny to do a let's play like that, but it would be terrible for my computer. I probably would have burned out the uh, GPU or the. I don't know. And I don't think I can deliberately achieve that same result. Oh my god. Heather is a bony girl. She is scrawny. Look at her. I didn't notice this till just now, but look at her arms. Yeah, she is pretty tiny. Just makes her look a little bit more bulky. Yeah. Hmm. Oh, 
Okay, well that answers that. I um, hit my head the other day while cleaning the dog room, and I was swearing up a storm, because I, I was in a lot of pain. But I didn't know, um, I didn't know whether or not I was bleeding, and I just like felt a scab on the back of my head while I was scratching an itch. So uh, that answers that question. Yes, I probably was bleeding to some extent. Oh jeez. And I didn't even notice. What the hell is growling in the subway? We're not even in the other world. What's going on? Uh, that's very weird. <laughs> that's not good. I think that these are the beta sounds that got restored by the um, patch. But fuck me. I'm trying to find a place to save my game. Because we killed the boss and it does not save automatically. That's kind of not cool, game. Can't open. And I still haven't even eaten dinner. Last time I ate something, it was like 1.30. Oh, jeez. Yes! It's the halo of the sun. I never thought I'd be so happy to see a demonic sigil. Alright, it is 11.57. We will resume this game tomorrow evening at the same time. Um... 7.30 or 8.45. I know we got a bit later start tonight, but that's because I had to uh, trim my cat's nails because he was being a butt, and I got scratches and covered in cat hair, so I had to shower because I was drenched in sweat and, sweat and all that. Um, let's, find a, let's find somebody to raid.